Hey guys, so I wanted to start the year off with this video, but I could not decide and I know I get a lot of questions of people asking me what products do I love, what's my staple DC, what conditioner do I like the best, what co-wash do I like the best, and yada 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 yada. So I figured I would just make this video and give you the top 14 products that I found in 2013. And these products are going to roll over into 2014 with me. So these are 14 products in no particular order. But I absolutely love these 14 products. And I'm definitely, you'll see them throughout 2014. Some of these products I have done a review on. And if I have, I'll leave it down in the description box below. But if I have not and you're interested in seeing me do it. And I'll probably mention if I have or have not done the review on it then um, leave it down in the comment section and I'll be sure to try to do a review for you. So first up is this shampoo and this is the African Pride Shea Butter Miracle Shampoo and this is a detangling shampoo. They have several of these and I absolutely love this. I have done a review on this already so I will leave it down in the description box. This is an awesome cleanser. Um, I've also had someone else try it and they loved it as well. It is a sulfate shampoo but it also has the non-sulfate um, surfactant that y people use usually in non-sulfate shampoos. So it has double the detergents, but it leaves your hair feeling amazing. And it does have some slip, which I, you really can't say about most shampoos. So I absolutely love this shampoo and definitely will utilize it more. Hopefully I can find it on the ground because it's probably like about here now. Um, next up is the Obia Natural Moisture Cream. This one here is the His Moisture Cream. It's the same thing as the one that's in the pink label except it has more of a manlier scent. I used up the one that had the pink label already. So I'm using this one now. All I did was add in a little bit of watermelon oil to cover up the scent. But this works amazing. I'm able to utilize this on um, dry hair. And as you see it's really light. Really light but it detangles your hair like a dream and you don't run across too many moisturizers that do that type of thing but i absolutely love this and it comes at a very reasonable price and she often has 40 and 50 percent off sale so when i run out of this i definitely will be picking it up and as you see i switch from the pink label to the blue label and i love it love it love it it works the very same Next up is this Edge Control by Going Natural. This is their Silk Edge Control. And this thing is amazing. Y'all know I used to love the Curls Control Paste. But I love this so, so much more. The Curls Control Paste only comes in a 4 ounce. And this comes in a 12 ounce. And I want to say it's about $12 normal price. But she often has sales for $10. So you can get this 12 ounce of Edge Control for just $10 and as you see I've been using it a ton and as long as I've been using this I think I've had this for about five or six months and I use it almost on every style that I do um, I haven't really made a dent in it so this is gonna last me a really really long time next up is my Denman brush and this is the one that I use. I know a lot of people use the 9 row Denman. This one here is the 7 row Denman. I use this to detangle my hair. Works like a dream. I don't have any problems detangling my hair underwater. I purchased this off Amazon. I will leave the link down below. Um, if you're interested in getting one for yourself. I know Marquita83 also got one and she loves it as well. So this thing is the bomb. You do not have to modify it. As you see the rolls are already spaced out for you. Next up is this Blended Beauty. And this is their Curly Frizz Pudding. I have not done this in a wash and go yet. But I absolutely love the way that it left my hair defined. I've already done a review on this, so I'll leave it down in the description box as well. It smells amazing. It smells like um, the Jergens Cherry Almond. This is my second container of this that lets you know that I love, love, love it. 
Um, I know they had a couple of awesome sales towards the end of last year with like 30% off and 25% off. So leaves it really affordable even though this is a Canadian company. They do have a United States base so you don't have to pay the exorbitant amount of shipping fees and customs and all of that stuff. So you don't have to worry about that. Next up, I have not done a review on this line but this is my second bottle I've run through and I've already listed it in my staples video. This is the Design Anion Natural. This is their hair smoothie. This thing is amazing and I want to show you. It's like super thick. Like look how thick that is. Like it just stands up on itself and it leaves your hair so moisturized and it's made with um I know it has argan oil which you guys know I love argan oil but some of the first couple of ingredients of it is water, aloe vera gel, um, shea butter, cocoa seed butter, coconut oil. Oh, I guess there is no argan oil in this one. But it smells also amazing as well. It smells really, really good. I absolutely love this stuff. I will use it on my hair like straight out the bottle and I also use it diluted down when you often see this spray bottle that's what's in here is water mixed with uh, this and a little bit of oils but I absolutely love this keeps my hair moisturized for a very very long time this is my favorite co-wash and this here is the L'Oreal um, Sulfate Free Curl, Curl, Curl Care System and this is their cleansing conditioner and I actually ended up getting this doing one of my naturally curly reviews. This is one of the only co-washes that I have run across that also suds up. It's more like a foamy sud, not necessarily like a shampoo type sud. But a little bit of this goes a very long way. Um, I was able to use this especially when I was working out and getting in and out of the pool a lot. It did not strip my hair or anything like that. It works really, really great. Um, very affordable price. I have not seen this in stores yet, but then again, I haven't really been looking. But I will definitely keep this. I utilize this often. Works very, very good. Um, next up is my favorite off the ground deep conditioner and this is the Naturel Grow and I have done a review for this and this is their mango and coconut water deep conditioner um, this is my second jar of it so that's what it looks like and she makes a bunch of different products she's only on Etsy and um, she just started up her Instagram she has a Facebook page as well so I'll leave those links down in the description box if you choose to follow them but this stuff works amazing has a ton of slip leaves my hair very moisturized almost comparable to my beloved mixed silk um, deep conditioner that got discontinued a couple years ago but I absolutely love that and so while we're on the topic of deep conditioners this is my favorite on the ground and this is the organic root stimulator which they now changed the name to ORS and this is their hair repair nourishing conditioner and it smells like bananas and these only come in packets right now I really wish they would put this in a bottle because this stuff is like crack to me like I would use this every single week this stuff is amazing. There is a full review on that. If you want to see it, I'll leave it down. I also love these jaw clips. These are what I utilize in my hair to section them off. Um, any brand works fine. These in particular come from FlatironExperts.com. And these are the QT Performance ones. But I have them, you know, just that I found in a beauty supply store that looks like this as well. So I absolutely love jaw clips they hold the hair very securely especially when you're in the shower next up is hair accessories in particular these easy combs these come in handy when you have an old style and you really don't feel like doing anything in your hair you just slick down the front throw this on and go and everybody just thinks that you done did your hair if you do the front of your hair people normally assume you've done your whole head so I love those for that particular reason. Next up is my Curl Collection subscription. With them, I have been able to come across a bunch of companies that I would not have known even existed. So I definitely am keeping my Curl Collection subscription. So you definitely will have more of these unboxings and reviews from them. 
And last but not least is my ebony curls. This is a cheat. <laughs> well, these aren't the last ones, but we're going to group these together as my number 12. I mean number 13. This is the Ebony Curls e-bonnet and this is the shower cap and these I am normally not a bonnet person but if I get in the mood to wear a bonnet I definitely choose to utilize this one. It is huge. Like do you see how huge this is? Like do you are you convinced now? <laughs> like this thing is huge and contains everything was even able to contain my curl formers when I had them in my hair it's also reversible so you can wear it on both sides as you see it's two different linings so I absolutely love that and although I think she says do not wash it I've washed it and they wash it on delicate and I've had no problem with it so do that on your own circumstances and then this here is their shower cap and as you see it's lined as well on the inside it has that same satin material then on the outside is neoprene fabric like a thin plastic and I also have been able to utilize this by turning it inside out and using it as a um, deep conditioner you know to heat up for my deep conditioner oh I want to cheat again I absolutely love my hot head. This is what I use to deep condition my hair. So I guess this is going to be 15 things that I'm bringing. But who's counting? These are all my favorite things that I, you know, just love. And you will see a lot of this year. This is my hot head. And this is what I use to deep condition my hair. And this, um, I don't know how close you're going to be able to see. But I have a full review on this as well. It has these pockets and in these pockets are flaxseed gel so you just heat this up in the microwave and it retains the heat for about a good 25-30 minutes. I usually do about two cycles of heating this up and then putting it on my hair to allow the deep conditioner to penetrate through. And last but not least are my glasses that I ended up getting from Fermu.com. But it can be from anywhere. I think in particular I really love white glasses. I think it's just like my signature thing and I just absolutely love it. So if you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you have anything that you want to see a review of, which I think I've done most of these reviews. Probably the only thing I have not done a separate review for is this but I did include it in my staple um, leave-in conditioners um, list for it so I don't know I think I reviewed all of those though everything else but um, if you have any comments questions or concerns leave them down in the comment section below and I will get back to you as soon as possible be blessed happy 2014